How's it going everyone? Wild Dang here and welcome to a brand new Destiny video. So in this video I'm going to show you guys what the reward is when you've completed the Blade Dancer's quest path. It is a class item and we can't wear it yet. You have to be level 40, just like the Gunslinger one. Um, so let me just show you what it is. So here it is. It's called Blade Dancer's Cloak, obviously. Uh, it's the reward that you get for completing the quest. Um, I think it's the pass of the Blade Dancer. As you can see, it's got a like a, a knife blade on the back of it. Uh, it's blue. I don't think it changes with the shader that you're wearing either, which is pretty cool. So we have infused consume a more powerful piece of armor to boost the defense value of this armor. So you can just use like any sort of cloaks that you don't like wearing or you've, you've not worn for ages. Stick it on this one and it will be good. So you can use armor materials, motes and light, and legendary marks. Moving on, we have increase intellect, increase intellect bonus provided by this piece of gear, increase strength, increase the strength bonus provided by this piece of gear. So you can increase your intellect and strength there. You can also see that this is a defense 220, which is a lot more than the stuff that you currently have. Pulse rifle focus and fusion rifle focus. So these two will allow me to upgrade these these two types of weapons are a lot faster than normal. Pulse Rifle is going to be very, very good because I think they're going to be the new meta in this DLC, in this uh, update as well. A lot of people are rocking the Red Death Bad Juju uh, Messenger, so that is going to be extremely useful depending on what sort of pulse, rif pulse rifles we get. Fusion Rifles, I'm not a huge fan of, so I don't know if I'm going to be using that at all. <laughs> And then we have Vanguard Champion, increases your Vanguard reputation gain, so that's also very useful. So, yeah, looking at the cape, it looks very nice. I do prefer the Gunslinger one, just because I am a Gunslinger. But this is still pretty cool, I will be rocking it at some point, just for those boosts as well. Um, so that's pretty cool. So, so like I said guys, you have to complete the quest, which is called a Blade Dancer's Path. A lot of people, like, Bungie have put on Twitter that they that they shouldn't complete them because apparently they're bugged or there's issues with them. I'm not sure if I was supposed to get something else with this cloak. I don't know if you're supposed to get, like, an emblem maybe or something else. But nevertheless, I have completed it. I have got it. I've not seen any issues yet. I don't know what the actual issue is. But save it until the DLC comes out just in case. And like the like my dead orbit quest I can't actually complete this yet because I do need to go talk to I need to talk to Iraq but he won't give me the reward because it doesn't it's not available until the Taken King because you do get an exotic as you can see in the rewards you get an exotic a motor light and some experience so so hopefully it's not bugged and hopefully it doesn't reset which would be extremely annoying but anyway guys hopefully you enjoyed the video if you did please do smash that like button and subscribe if you haven't already and I will see you in the next one. They stopped your spark run. Double down. Spark charging. <laughs>